Welcome back cruisers and we hope you had a good weekend. Thank you for joining us on today's daily cruise news updates. We have three new stories coming your way and we see which cruise ship has shortened its itinerary. All news fed directly to you from cruisehive.com. Carnival Jubilee emerged from its construction dock on July 21st at its renowned shipyard in Papenburg, Germany amidst much anticipation. The ship majestically glided into the waters of the River Ems, making a significant milestone in its construction process. But what truly stole the show was its striking bow, adorned with an iconic Texas star symbolising the ship's connection to its home port in the Lone Star state of Texas. The emblem is the first of its kind ever displayed on a Carnival cruise ship, as it pays homage to the Lone Star State as the vessel will be based out of the port of Galveston in Texas towards the end of the year. Now with the float out behind it, its sea trials are scheduled for November 2023, before embarking on its maiden voyage, setting sail on a mesmerising Western Caribbean itinerary towards the end of December 2023. And just a little skip from Germany and into Amsterdam we go. In a move intended to curb pollution and manage tourism, the Amsterdam City Council has voted to prohibit cruise ships from docking in the city centre. Now while cruise ships were welcomed with open arms before, it seems the current city government wishes to ban cruise ships entirely from the city limits and discourage tourists from visiting the Dutch capital. The Amsterdam Cruise Terminal is located next to the Amsterdam Central Station and within walking distance of the historic Old City, and it would be a considerable inconvenience for visiting cruise ship passengers having to use buses or public transportation. Amsterdam is set to receive a total of 73 cruise ship visits through the end of 2023, so whether the new policies will indeed be implemented remains a question. However, the Council believes banning cruise ships will send out a message that it is serious about limiting tourism. And completing our daily updates, we move away from Northwestern Europe and on to Carnival Pride in the UK, as Carnival Cruise Line had confirmed that Carnival Pride is sailing a shortened six-night itinerary following the completion of its propulsion repairs and that the new cruise will end as previously scheduled in Dover on Sunday, July the 30th. Now, the original nine-night itinerary cruise was scheduled to sail on July the 21st from Dover, Colnut destinations as Edinburgh, Belfast in Northern Ireland, Holyhead in Wales and Cork in Ireland before returning to Dover. Now, guests had been informed that the ship will instead sail an abbreviated six-night itinerary with two days at sea. So, while this change is dramatic, it's a far cry from cancelling the sailing entirely, which was initially feared. And that's another one that bites the dust cruisers. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch the video. My name is Paul, bringing you the latest cruise news from around the globe. Please check out our website on cruisehive.com. If you wish to be kept updated with all the news in the world of cruising, then don't forget to like our channel and hit that subscribe button. Thank you once again, cruisers, and have a great day.